Hello, Fada. Here I am at Camp Granada. Camp is very entertaining. And they say we'll have some fun if it stops raining. I went hiking with Joe Spidella. Poison Ivy. You remember Leonard Skinner. He got ptomaine poisoning last night after dinner. Hate the waiters and the lake has alligators. And the head coach wants no sissies. So he reads to us from something called Ulysses. Summer camp. Is it really fun in the sun, swimming and boating? Or is there more to it than all that? Is there something else? We'll take a look at this tonight. Hello, I'm Matthew Elman. And I'm Mark Thompson. In a moment, this and other stories, tonight on 60 Minutes. Hey kids, got any dirty clothes? Yeah, Ma, I was playing football and now you got the shirt to me. Okay. Day was soon. I got grease on my jacket. Clean the car. How the heck did you do that? Clean the car. Come in. Hello. How are you today? Fine with my washing machine busted. Well, what happened? It just doesn't start. Well, I bought some new shower in my car. I'll get it for you. All you have to do is just put it in and shout it out. Okay. Directions. Just yell at the shirts and anything will come out. Okay, I'll try it. Now this greasy dirt. Now you shirts! Come clean! Otherwise, I'm gonna yell my head off! It works. I don't believe it. That dumb little shrimp. How did he get these? Three. He said he fell in the money closet, but every day. That little dick is. I'm gonna yell. Ah! This isn't that bad. You don't fell in the money closet. Oh, brother. How am I gonna get this out? Yes, you just gonna have to get the old yell treatment. Okay! Tomato. Here we are at Soldier's Field. In this corner, weighing 200 pounds, Muhammad Ali. Yay! In this corner, weighing 202 pounds, Rocky Balboa. No 
Summer camps. Those hot July and August days filled with fun, friendship, and excitement. Or is that all? Recent reports of candy smuggling and bug juice overdoses have prompted a congressional investigation into the operation of such summer camps. 60 Minutes visited one such camp several months ago to find out for ourselves exactly what goes on at such a summer camp. Camp Henry Horner. At present, I'm standing in front of Camp Henry Horner, which is located in Round Lake, Illinois. Camp Henry Horner is both a day camp and a residential camp. Children ages 5 through 14 attend camp here. Today, I and the 60 Minutes crew are going to take you on a trip to Camp Henry Horner. A typical day at Camp Henry Horner begins with the arrival of the buses. And then the campers meet their counselors. One of the activities that seems to be the most favorite here at Camp Henry Horner is softball. The kids love it. Wherever you look, you can see a softball game in action. Excuse me, what's your name? My name is Jason Jacobson. Oh, hello Jason. Do you like camp here? Sometimes. Oh, you guys sure like to seem like to play softball. You're playing it all the time. Do you like to play softball? No, I hate it, but my counselor loves it. Oh. with such enthusiasm. How do you feel? Get out of here! Wait a second. Sorry, <laughs> Another activity here at Camp Henry Horner that seems to be a real favorite among the campers is pillow polo. Yes, pillow polo. It's sort of like field hockey, but they use these sticks that have pillows on the bottom so no one gets hurt. It's sort of another non-competitive, friendly, non-violent game. <laughs> 